Welcome Leo and Cross Watchers. This is your general love reading for March 23rd through the 29th. Leo, it looks like somebody's coming in with that cup of love for a relationship with the Queen of Wands here. Uh, stick around, let's see where this goes. Hi, and welcome to Quartz Rose Tarot. Please keep in mind that all my readings are general readings and they will not resonate with everyone. They can resonate in reverse, but if it's not your story, don't try to make it fit. So take it how it resonates with you. Also, I would like to thank everyone for their love and support. We have hit 10,000 subscribers plus. Uh, there are several ways to support our channel. There's a donation link. There's also merchandise available in the description box below. If you're looking to get a personal reading with me, you can reach me at www.courtsrosetarot.com. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And let's get into this and see where it goes. Leo, you start off your read with a Knight of Cups. This is Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Somebody's coming towards you to offer you a new beginning in love. Under that, we have the Hierophant. This is Taurus. This is about foundations and tradition and relationships. Under that, we have the Queen of Wands. This is Leo with the sun, uh, the sun, with the sunflower, sunflower representing Leo. Okay, so this is Aries Leo Sag, but more Leo here. Uh, someone who's very pretty. Uh, she's a lot of fun to be around. She's very passionate. She's waiting, though. She's waiting. She could be at a distance waiting about this, wanting to move past a conflict, wanting to move from rough waters to calm waters about something, feeling very discontent about this situation. So this love offer is coming in. Someone's wanting to re a relationship, but she's waiting about this, wanting to over overcome a conflict feeling discontent. She may have blocked somebody or she's trying to overcome something, maybe overcome an obstacle to move forward with this soulmate. You have Gemini here. This is about a choice, but this is also about a soulmate because it sits right next to the center of your read. You have the Ace of Cups. So you've got new love coming in. You have new love coming in here. Um, Whatever this is, you're right. You're trying, you're waiting to overcome something that, uh, to move forward. You're waiting to move forward discontent about overcoming an obstacle with this person, the soulmate. But it's going to balance out. You're going to have some balance here with Sagittarius. The angels are helping you here. You've got the angel here balancing the fire and the water. There's an apology here. So you're getting an offer of an apology. So uh, you're trying to overcome an obstacle that has to do with love. There's an apology and a, and a new beginning of love that's being offered. Wanting to work and collaborate with you. I don't see this as a third party. It's coming under the Ace of Cups. So they're wanting to work and collaborate with you on something. They're looking at the past. And that's what they're apologizing for, whatever happened in the past. This was a committed, solid relationship, something that had all the abundance you could possibly need. But somebody here is still very anxious and up in their head about this. Taking a leap of faith. You know, you're, you, this also could be Leo. You got the sun right there. Uh, the full card, you know, some people say it's air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Some say it's Aries. Some say it's, uh, I'm saying it could be also be uh, Leo because you got the sun in the background here. So taking that leap of faith, jumping off that, that, uh, that cliff right there. You're making a decision. You're at a crossroads about this. You're at a crossroads on whether or not you want to reconcile this relationship. You have the judgment card here. Reconcile and have a new solid, stable beginning again. 
you're anxious about this, Leo. This is, uh, you're having hope. There's hope here with Aquarius for a family situation. You know, this is happy wife, happy life, having all the cups filled. But I see you're guarded and, uh, you know, you're, you're uh, discontent. You want to move forward. You're waiting. You're trying to overcome obstacles and you're anxious about it. But it's new love. It's a new love relationship. Under the bottom of the deck, you got justice coming in. So this is Libra. You're getting justice for something. You're making a head over heart decision. You know, there may have been a secret that, that may be what you're having a problem with, a secret. You've you got a blindfold and there's the moon in the background, something you're not aware of. But you're going to get justice the, in, and clarity. you got the hermit here. So shedding some light on something, getting clarity. So the justice, making a decision, getting clarity for wish fulfillment. This is wish fulfillment, the nine of cups to move forward. This is cancer with the chariot moving forward quickly. You could be at a distance from this person again. Somebody from your past, past life soulmate or a soulmate. I see a strong soulmate bond here because the truth is being spoken, okay? Now, whatever you were anxious about, you're getting clarity and the truth is being spoken. You're getting a lot of communication, a lot of back and forth communication, and it's truthful communication to move forward, to have that wish fulfillment with the, uh, the sun card. You're gonna have success here, okay? This is also Leo. Leo, uh, very nice reading. Um, I, you're up in your head about something, but um, you're going to move forward. You're going to get the clarity you need to go forward and have this new beginning in love. So I hope this resonates with you. If it does, please leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I hope you have a wonderful week.